Good morning, everyone. This is Trey from Midwest Day Trips. Today, we are at Lone Elk Park in St. Louis County. So the story with this place is it was established by the county after World War II, which as you know ended in 1945. So then by the time the Korean War rolled around in 1950, the federal government actually decided to seize this property and they destroyed all the wildlife for safety reasons except for one elk that got by, which then was used to repopulate the, um, the park along with some elk that they got from the St. Louis Zoo later on after the um, it was no longer federal property anymore. So anyway, that's how the park got its name. So for the most part, this is a drive-through park. Right now we're in the bison area and you're not supposed to get out in the bison area. But as far as I know, you can get out in any other part of the park. So one thing we find pretty cool about this area is there's some structures all over the park, such as this one. Like, I have no idea what this structure is or was, but if I had to guess, I would say that this structure along with many probably predate the park itself. And then there's this one, which looks like it was built for the benefit of the animals. So it's probably newer.
So when you get to see the buffalo up close, you get to see them in their full majesty and beauty. And it becomes apparent how they were almost driven to extinction back in the day because they were hunted for their pelts. All right, we just finished the drive-through portion of Lone Elk Park. Now we're gonna check out the World Bird Sanctuary. is a peregrine falcon. Baby, baby. Yep, this one's a red-tailed hawk. It is a birdie. It's a swallow-tailed kite. A broad winged hawk and a Swainson's hawk. This one is a great horned owl. Can you see the owl? Is it wearing a mask? It is. I think that is the emu. It is the emu making the noise. Yeah. So here we have some white pelicans. And this beautiful creature is the Andean condor. Dorothy, the Andean condor. So we just talked to a staff member. Here we have Dorothy. She was actually hatched here. And um, he thinks that it was maybe 15 years ago. So, you know, that's about how old she is. And here we have Anastasia, who's only been here since the spring of 2020. So she's a stellar sea eagle and she's only two years old. Red-headed vulture. Here we have a red golden pheasant who is at the moment trying to hide from me. That's okay though. Auger buzzard. Sandhill crane. This is a black crowned night heron. This is a Harris hawk. This beauty is 
is. Let's see. A turkey vulture. Admission to everything we've seen today is free, but donations are highly encouraged. and he's just resting right over there. Over in this enclosure we have a raven and up here not sure how well you can see that but we have a crow. I'll be honest with you I really don't know the difference between the two I just know which one is which because of the signs on the enclosures. Anyway, that's going to about do it for today, so don't forget to like and subscribe. Check back frequently for brand new content. Take care.